here's the startup animation for the Froyo Cream ROM that you can get on Android forums. Uh, all things root uh, sub forum, and uh, it's just a lot cooler. I mean, look how cool that is compared to the retarded Virgin Mobile um, loading screen. Of course, I'm going to get rid of that retarded sound, but uh, it has its own custom sounds and stuff too, but whatever. Um, the good thing about this is um, HDMI works. I have it hooked up to my TV, and it works pretty well. The reason I say that is uh, if you know anything about Android, uh, if you know anything about the custom ROMs that are out there right now, um, Cyanogen Mod, HDMI doesn't work. And uh, I think that's a pretty nice feature to have because, I mean, look at the difference in size. I mean, this is only a 24-inch TV, but whatever. So here's the, this is the No Frills controller. There's a bunch of them on the market. Oops. Oh, dear. But you got your little, nice little icons, uh, 3G. It looks a lot like... Android 4.4, 4.1, 4 4.0, what's wrong with me, 4.0, alright, oh, I need a better camera, yeah, but it has the kernel built in to where it'll let you go up to 2 gigahertz and down to 61 megahertz, but there's no, there's really no reason to go up to 2 gigahertz unless you're uh, the highest I would go is 1.5, maybe, but I if if you're just uh, it's probably only if you're gonna be playing like games like the game loft games. But everything works. Uh, YouTube works. In portrait view. Let's see here. Trust me, it works. I don't really need to prove this. Just believe me. And I'm going to show you the little custom animation it does when you go to turn it off. Also, the volume bar is kind of cool. It's uh, blue instead of yellow. Let's see. Let's see, look at Isn't that cool? Alright, that was it. Uh, you can uh, find more about this at uh, Android forums, how to install and stuff, it's really easy.